I don't want her to like grow up and feel like her whole life is about her skin. Within minutes of being born, baby Anna's skin painfully cracked and peeled. So when they when they took her out, she dried within minutes and like she was crying, she was in pain and her skin became hard like like leather. The result of a rare skin condition called harlequin ichthyosis. But see harlequin is basically it's a mutation in a gene that like doesn't let you, your skin form its last layer correctly. Anna's mom, Jenny, says her daughter's body tries to heal itself, producing skin at an accelerated rate. She and her husband didn't know Anna had the condition until she was born via a C-section. The doctor said, um, she has a birth defect. That's what he said first. And I, you know, in my head, I was like, well, that's, that's fine. She's missing, you know, she has extra fingers. She's missing an arm. Like we can, we can fix anything. It's 2017. I was thinking like, what is there? Like, that's that bad. Jenny's husband saw her first. He just said like, he's like, it's bad. He said, it, it's just bad. And he said, um, but I, I looked into her eyes and she has the most beautiful soul. She was in humidity control and then, you know, slowly the skin just began to come off, the extra skin. When doctors finally took Anna out of the box, she was almost a month old. Now 15 months old, Anna is thriving, proving to be a beam of light in the lives of everyone she meets. Her parents take special precautions to care for her, and her two brothers adore her. Bison stuff. So the giant bison. I mean, like, whenever she cries, he sings a song to her that's like, and he made it up. It's literally like, when you cry, then that's okay, and he just sings it over and over. <laughs> Anna bathes for at least four hours a day to help her skin. And when she's in a bath, um, the water helps to expand the skin cells and then it helps complete the shedding process. We have a lot of fun in the bath. <laughs> She's, uh, she likes to play music and, and dance. Since she can't sweat or naturally control her temperature, the outdoors can be dangerous for Anna. So she can't control her temperature, so she can't be outside in the heat or she'll overheat. If she goes outside in the cold, um, the air can be a lot drier. That will majorly affect her. Um, and also, if she starts to shiver, she can overheat that way, too. Anna has a healthy appetite, twice that of an average baby her age. She eats, like, 2,100 calories a day without issue. So, like, she will... I can't share a plate with her. <laughs> like, she just downed the entire taco. <laughs> and she's going to have another one. Is it good? Yeah. Okay. She eats constantly. So... And that's, that's because, um, so they use all that extra calories to, to grow the skin at the accelerated rate. Because of her condition, Anna's life will never be, quote, ordinary. She's more than her disease. But for such a beautiful little girl with the heart and fight of a champion, why not be extraordinary? I'm Kelly Nealon for InsideEdition.com.